video may contain content parents may find unsuitable for children. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Country Ball. My name is Hunger, and let's get started. Don't underestimate us, we've got WMDs. Uh-oh. WMDs? That's not fair. Wait, that's illegal. Sarabian Hadir. He's got... Hello. Hey. <laughs> okay, it's a fighting type. We got this. Fight him on equal terms. Just, just keep, just keep kicking him. Are you threatening me? I feel like you're threatening me. Are you threatening me? No. Hey, there goes Laos. Weapons of mass disappointment. <laughs> yes. I'll get the drop on you yet, traveler. Our future is as bright as these sun bleached sands. Challenged by Sarabian Farouk. Oh gosh. He's got a Tonga. Look at it. It's so Tonga. Eat. What happened? I heard there was a Tonga here. What, what happened to it? Confused. Shock tactic? What does this do? Wait a minute. What, is, what does shock tactic do? Rapid flurries of attacks. Is this is this razor leaf? Is that what that's supposed to be? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of ambush for that. It's like way more power points. And it's more power, so. Actually, you know what? Let's get rid of sanction instead. We'll take both. We'll have both of them. Still ambush things with 100% accurate accuracy, or I can shock tactic things. Tonga again, because it didn't learn the first time. All right, come here, Bop. Get the fuck out of here. That's right. Gotcha. And our defeat feels as cold as the desert nights. Yeah, that's right. Burr, it's cold out all of a sudden. Think you can withstand the heat of the Arabian sun? Alright. This man. Sarabian Nadim. Nauru. <laughs> I love this thing. It's just so sad. Should I... Shock tactic. Yeah, it's razor leaf. Bop! And it's gone. Ouch, I forgot my sunscreen. <laughs> sunscreen? I think I'm getting a sunburn. Um, aren't you a bit warm in that jacket of yours? Alright, this, this is a glitch. <laughs> Can't walk past this, uh, spot. People in Serbia collect rain and beat bases on their roof. Then sh shared by the whole city through aqueducts. Technology is incredible. I'm not even here to buy anything, I just love the air conditioning. There's a huge scramble to find the treasure of the tomb north of town. Head to Sheikdun Sands by, by taking the gate in the south part of town if you would like to take a peek. Be warned, the people of Sarabia and the Sheikdun Sands are hardened folk. Adventuring and battling is in their blood and culture. Arg, this Sarabian won't let me be! What's your problem, buddy? Yeesh, those two over there have been bickering all afternoon. This area doesn't get a whole lot of rainfall, so we make do by distributing water around the city via the aqueduct system. Neat, huh? Everyone handles problems in their own way. But at the end of the day, assistance will rarely go unappreciated. My grandmother used to tell me that the prickliest cactus hides the most beautiful blossom. I wonder what she meant by that. Wow, you came all the way from Leafland? Be careful not to melt. This doorway leads to Sheikdom Sands at the Tomb of Anubis. I'd be careful if you plan on going. I heard the pyramids were built by country balls in ancient times, but it might just be a tall tale. Don't let the heat fool you, it can get quite cold around here after the sun sets. My son told me that he saw a woman waving at him from atop the pyramid. I've warned him many times about the dangers of heat stroke. My brother and I receive strange looks when we tell people we're related. 
I've never understood why. Walking on the sand can be quite disorienting for those not used to it. Watch your step. Legend has it there's a beautiful woman on top of the pyramid. What could cause someone to believe such a thing? Local myths and legends are always so fascinating. They can say just as much about a location as the people who live there oftentimes. Weak men seek power while strong men seek to empower. Remember this when deciding who to follow into battle. I'm fortunate to have found a place for sale in the city. All my relatives still live in the cliff town of Sheikdom Sands. Sure is, uh, dusty around these parts. Up ahead is the library of Serabia. It's been abandoned ever since the racetrack opened, though. The only person who's ever se seen there now is the mayor of Serabia, Saladin. They say he spends all day there with his ground-type country balls. This man is busting up with his pal over lunch. Better not disturb him. You'd think a guy could get a decent drink once in a while. This place is dry in more ways than one. I've heard stories of an oasis not too far from here, but I've never seen it myself. I have to wonder if it's really there at all. Light, loose-fitting clothing is essential in climates like this. Always dress for success. Another beautiful day. Sigh. Between you and me, I'd give anything for a good bit of rain. My country ball was poisoned. It's a good thing I was close to here. Sorry, no talking till I finish my coffee. I wish they served food here. Yeah, free healthcare and lunch. So while I'm here in the Pokemon Center, uh, getting patched up, I figured I'd mention that uh, the game was patched up recently. Uh, yesterday, as a matter of fact, if uh, if this game if if this video makes it out the day I record it, which it should. Uh, so yeah, uh, new area was added. So if anybody has reached the end of the demo already, there's more of it now. And uh, yeah, we're gonna keep going. Up ahead is the racetrack, which attracts thousands of travelers, not unlike yourself, every season. New sights are great and all, but nothing beats the warmth of home. You don't look like you're from our little town here. Where are you from? Few are fortunate enough to find someone who can brighten their days, even when the sun cannot. I consider myself very lucky. Life and love are full of these things we call compromises. Success in either is all about making the right ones. Welcome to the Arabian racetrack. Enjoy your stay. Good lord, they ain't got this in Bergopolis, that's for sure. Look at all these people from totally different cultures and locales together for sport. How sweet. It wasn't easy getting all the way here from Lakeside. But man, it's worth the trip. Quiet, man, I'm trying to watch. Sorry, amigo, no time to chat. I'm betting this match. This doesn't seem humane. Arabia! Arabia! Go, 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 go! What? I'm cheering. Mind? I'm here for sport, not chit chat. All of this competition. Oh my. You again. Here to race? Um, no. Don't worry, you're not alone. Not many can handle the heat of the track. How's the race work? I'll be interested in seeing your performance. Do you need an excellent. Yes. Here's a quick rundown. Four racers will enter their country ball. Each racer will hop into a full lap around the track. Press A button to hop. The higher your country ball's energy, the faster you can hop. First racer to take a full lap around the center pyre wins that race and ascends to the next round. Okay, the third race is the final four. Winner takes all. Huge grand prize. All right. Who will you be racing with? Ah, Colony U.S., Muscovy, England, Arabia. I guess I got to go with uh, Colony U.S. since I don't have any of the rest. Actually, it's the... I got the evolved form, so I don't know. Oh, do you just get to pick one? Okay, three, two, one. I have no idea what's... Oh my gosh. My country's having so many problems hopping. Hey, I won. <laughs> Next round, three, two, one. Oh my gosh. My poor colony, US. I lose. I lose so bad. <laughs> Sorry, looks like today isn't your day. Okay, so I guess you just get to pick a country ball to race with. Because I technically don't have a colony US anymore. Alright, because it evolved. Come back in again sometime. You put on one hell of a show. Alright, so here we are at the Sheikdom Sands. Are you heading to the Pyramid 2? Let's test our skills to pass some time. I What is this guy? Cliffman Abraham? Okay. Nice powerful Monaco. Alright. Um Monaco is actually a really bad matchup for me. I'ma switch. 
this is a much better matchup. Don't don't rope me up. I'm so sick of this. All right. Was this thing's back sprite updated? I don't remember its back sprite looking like that. It's possible. I think he updated a couple of sprites as well in, in the recent updated, but I'm, I, I'm not 100%. If there are if there are sprite updates, it's probably pretty minor stuff. There, there goes that. Lebanon. Oh, wait, I should have stayed in. Lebanon's a grass type. Crud. All right. Get it there. <laughs> Let me use Greenland. <laughs> Get him. I stayed in without thinking. Y'all. Monaco. Okay. Let me switch back into this thing. Get him. Don't rope me. It's terrible. Hey! Look at that. You're tougher than limestone. Tourists often ask how we can stand to live in rock, but the durability means home insurance is very cheap. Belize blocks my path. Okay. I don't believe I have a Belize yet. So... Hmm. Should I just, uh... Should I just spy plants here? Spy plants. Oh, it's closing the border. It's closing the border. Look out. supposed to be? I actually like the idea of continuing to use spy plants on it if it can get rid of them. I feel like this, I feel like this is uh, normally a Staryu, or like, like this is using Staryu's moveset, basically. Alright, get it. Yes! Alright. Please. Please. Mike country. Mike is here. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna call it please. Please Belize. Being near the cliffs is only natural. I'd go anywhere for my... For your what? Finish your sentence, man. Cliffman Solomon. Canada. <laughs> Look at Canada! <laughs> it's got a mounty hat. It's amazing. Come on. Alright. Go on, then. Oh, I forgot this thing's water type now. Crap! Mind control? What are you using a psychic move for? Calm down! <laughs> The leaf type. I mean grass type. What did I say? Chloroform. What? What kind of freaky shit is Canada into? Mind control. What is this thing? It's acting like it's a butterfree. 
honestly. But it's all grass type. Mind control again, huh? Yeah, I, sh I shouldn't have switched that in. I was thinking, oh, it's an ice type, but I forgot it's also a water type, too, so. Get out of here. Bad Canada. As long as I don't look down. <laughs> you think we'd be used to the sand by now, but no. That stuff is a nightmare to deal with. You need a lot of metal to take on the Great Pyramid. Let's test yours. Ah, this is gonna be good. Cliffman Asher. Luxembourg. I have a thing for this. <laughs> Complete annihilation. Attack of the overleveled starter. Wernsey. Oh, look at Wernsey. Isn't that precious? Me. I should have switched. Hey, nice taser you got there. Have some freaking magnitude. Go ahead, I'll wait. Mag 7. Get him. Get wrecked. Get wrecked right now. Metal tested. This guy's a metal detector. Don't get lost in there. Ah, jeez. There's sand in my shoes. Cliffman Yakov. Oh, England. <laughs> I love England. Yes. Get out of here. Fucking cunt. Itchy, itchy. I ought to go home and vacuum my shoes. The pyramid is covered with lots of trainers looking for gold. I see. Cliffman Yosef. This man has a Tokelau. This is normal fight, normal flying? Is that what this is? It's a horrible type matchup for me. Did this thing always have a boat? I don't remember this thing being in a boat earlier. Like I said, there may have been some minor sprite updates in this most recent update. Taser. Tase him! Might just be remembering it wrong too, but uh, could have sworn that thing used to not have a boat. Netherlands, that's a flying type as well. Oh wait, no, it's a water ice. Never mind. I was confused. <laughs> Get it. Bop. Hey, get paralyzed. Get him, baby. Bebe. Alright, got him. I hope you're prepared. The pyramid is the largest and most strenuous endurance test you'll ever face. I hope you're ready. Challenged by Cliffman Yedija. Yedija? No idea. Aguila, isn't it? I don't know. Anguilla? I, I don't. I, I, it's poison type. I don't want to fight that. The switch. This is not the thing I want to fight a poison type with. Bargo. Tired of this. I'm trying to lower my defense. Have some magnitude. <laughs> the blast. 
Go ahead, blast me again. Up. That did not do enough. I need a, I need a higher magnitude. It's just anything over six. Magnitude 10. That works. That works. I'll take a mag 10. I'll take a mag 10. All day. Get him. <laughs> All right. Perfect. You could do it. Go get him, trainer. Okay, so the Tomb of Anubis is on the other side of this cave. I'm going to go ahead and do that next time. Thank you all so much for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. Look forward to that next one. And as always, I hope everybody has a great day. Bye-bye!